Hello friends of Ivy Tech South Bend Elkhart. I hope that you're staying safe and well during these unprecedented times and that you're following all CDC recommendations when in public. As you may know, the Ivy Tech Foundation recently launched a COVID-19 relief fund to help assist our students with the growing challenging challenges they're facing during this crisis. Thanks to the generosity of Mary Ann Glick, a $500,000 match has been committed to support this important campaign statewide. While we don't know what the ultimate impact from this pandemic will be, we do know that our students at the South Bend Elkhart campus need our support now. Although our college has been fortunate to have received federal funding from the CARES Act, that money will provide our students with one-time payments that will average only a few hundred dollars. In the coming days, weeks, months, and even years ahead, many of our students will need additional assistance with things like tuition and books, equipment, food, housing, mental health counseling, and a host of other resources. Therefore, it's our goal at the South Bend Elkhart campus to encourage as many of our 400 plus employees to give over the next 30 days through May 30th to the COVID-19 relief fund to help our students most in need for a longer term. Here's my commitment to you. After 200 employees give, I'll shave my beard. After 300 employees give, and this is much more difficult and painful for me, I commit to wearing University of Michigan attire every Friday until the first live Notre Dame football game is played. I hope you'll join me and our campus community in having a little fun, primarily at my expense, while supporting this important initiative that will directly benefit local Ivy Tech students. Please know that donations at any amount are greatly appreciated. To learn how to give, please see the additional information that was included in this email. Thank you for all your support. Stay safe, stay well, and I look forward to seeing you all very soon. Thank you.